Hi everyone, in this video we are going to see a few funding opportunities which are available for researchers, faculty, students. Before we proceed, I would like to show you that this is my channel that is Gomes Tech Talks. You can subscribe to the channel to get the latest videos. And I have two playlists, important playlists for all the researchers. So one is all about the research and second one is SEI Scopus and next show on UGC CAR Web of Science Index Journals. So this two playlist will be very, very useful for all the researchers. So you can find the journal which are indexed in these uh, important databases for all the domains. Okay, you can click here and see and this is all about the research. So let us proceed with the today's video. Everyone. So this is the very first opportunity which I wanted to discuss. This is a Google's research philosophy. That is Google is offering funding opportunity to the PhD who is aspiring to be a PhD. That is a doctorate. So here you can find this is the link research.google slash research.google. So you can just go and click here research.google in order to know about what all the research grants they are offering. Okay. And so here you can find the our existing research which are happening if your research is under under um, a specific areas like these are all the research areas which they are focusing on like algorithms in theory data mining and modeling economics and electronic commerce general science hardware and architecture information retrieval mission perception mobile system networking robotics software engineering speech processing so here you can see many areas they are covering okay health of course every area they are covering if your research is under these of any of none of these opportunities then definitely you can apply so here you can see what is the timeline they have to apply okay so they have a specific timeline where you should always uh, look through it okay so probably they are just accepting uh, during a march march 2023 why i am telling you now itself because you should start working on it so that you can create a complete proposal on how to create it everything so here you can find the research area and here you can find already published papers okay this is the area what are the research areas they have and what type of papers they have published you will get some idea into it and who are all already researchers if you want you can just click and connect through with them to in order to know about how and what are the expectations how they have really uh, uh, find the that is how they are really granted with this particular uh, research grant and everything okay and here you can see a few data sets which are available to you like if you want youtube uh, data set deep model generalization open images so they have some inbuilt data set if you wanted to make use of this, this you can use it okay and tools and services what are the tools they have data set search everything and this is the outreach okay this is for faculty academic research community through meaningful engagement for the university faculty and here you can apply academic research and everything so here you can see the complete information about the google research program so research scholar program if you just expand it you can find it okay you have various options here fellowship program phd fellowship recognize outstanding graduate students doing exceptional work in computer science so here if you click no you can find more information about what is this when you have to apply and uh, here you can click asia so here you can find that this is the note uh, application for the 2023 program will open in march 2023 so we have three months more in order to apply for this and if you start preparing now you can definitely do this okay and i hope this phd fellowship program you can if uh, you can just go and find the FAQs, okay, how to apply. Click here for the FAQ. No, completely, like learn everything. Okay, Africa, what type of, uh, in India, they are accepting up to four years fellowship and US 50K to cover stipend and other research related activity, travel expenses, overall travel. Okay, and Google Research Mentor. You will be having a Google Research Mentor. They'll be providing a research mentor. Last stage of, stage of PhD, they'll be providing $10K. I think this is for uh, one month. Okay, they are talking about one month. 
okay sorry this is for one year okay so four years i think this is for four years or uh, this is for uh, per year so you can just here they haven't given any clear information you can just connect with them and you can see is my university eligible what are the eligibility for the students okay everything everything you can find it over here okay this is a wonderful opportunity and you can find some blog here which is related to google research what they are currently doing and what type of research they are expecting all these things you can gather from here hope you find some useful here from this particular website the next one is what the uh, asian india collaborative r and d scheme so the deadline is 31 december okay 31 december is the deadline for this and here you can see the complete information about <clears throat> this particular thing so a uh, scientist with an appointment at a regular faculty researcher at any eligible indian asian ms institution holding phd degree the maximum age of so this is for uh, one who has already a phd degree okay so if you want to apply for this you can apply here so 31 december uh, is the last date i will leave this uh, link in the comment you can find it and the next one is what uh, the uh, eiffel scholarship program of excellence so this is for the master level okay the application of candidates from emerging countries for the master level and from emerging countries which is for the phd level so this is for ug the sorry pg and also for the phd okay so what are the steps they have mentioned you can just find it here you can see the complete information here in the link which is provided to you and the last date to submit is what 10 january 2023 you can find more information here in the in this particular website the last one is what the third call for application under fund of funds is for biotechnology innovation so this is for biotechnology related one okay and the deadline is 5 january you can see the deadline is for 5 january and what are the key in interest they are just uh, they are just concentrating on here you can find the application form and the detailed guidelines where you can find some more information about uh, what is the deadline of this when to apply how to apply and who are all um, eligible for this since this is a this is from india like you can apply uh, this is you can apply here it's a uh, head strategic partnership and ent entrepreneurship development biotechnology industry research assistant council and uh, here you can apply um, so here you can find the complete information like um, how to apply what are the content you have to uh, you have to use it here and they'll be having some documents what are the documents required who should uh, sign the document everything everything is available here in this particular um, particular link and also you can see the guidelines which are there in order to uh, submit uh, what are the guidelines you have to follow uh, uh, before you have to check while submitting or before submitting or after after submitting so you have all these informations here so start working for your um, for your research because uh, that is very very important uh, since we need at least one month of time in order to prepare all these things because we have to do the literature review everything so start uh, start looking for this and i request like i'm getting a lot of comments asking me ma'am please tell me uh, the research problem for research problem for my phd see please understand research problem identification is uh, is should be done by yourself because you know I can tell a research problem which is really whatever I understand I based on my expertise I'll be telling you the research problem so if I tell you the research problem completely you will be dependent on me so every time whatever you wanted to do for example if you wanted to go for the analysis if you need a data you have to you will be asking me if you wanted to do some uh, what to say if you wanted to do some implementation you will be asking me because you don't have any proper uh, understanding on the research problem then definitely you will end up with some prop you end up some with the end up with some confusions so for that what i can suggest you is go and explore some literature review already written paper at least within the five years of time 
explore the paper understand what is happening what is happening in the research what happened previously where it is really lagging and where do you need to give your contribution that is really very important i will not entertain such uh, thing like i don't imagine that i'll be giving you the research problem okay so you have to think definitely you can think so think or uh, read more research problem read more re literature review so that you will uh, understand what you wanted to do and then start working on it so you need at least one month of time to uh, to create a literature review to write a literature review to Uh, uh to understand what you are going to do with the uh, research and everything so that you can create a complete uh, grant here okay so that is possible from your end as well so start working on it hope you find this video very useful share with everyone because many will be uh, waiting for to know about the research grant this is important so please share it with everyone I'll be coming up with another exciting video in the next week so I'll be publishing one or two of uh, videos related to research every week thank you take care bye bye